key actions is this summit, and this is the first time we've ever held it, so it's lovely to see a great turnout. The intention of this is to share knowledge, network, gain insight into how we can support the rural areas as a vibrant local economy. We have six speakers today, and all of them are local, inspirational, subject matter experts who have been invited to cover priority issues from within the strategy. We also have many stands, as you know, outside the conference room with a wide range of specialists, community groups, organisations with expertise in working in the rural environment there to answer any questions. But together we can continue to grow a prosperous, sustainable and viable rural economy, strengthen our rural communities and protect our environment whilst creating economic prosperity. I share, I'm sure, with many of you the sort of preoccupations that we're going to be talking about today, all sorts of things. And it's really then important that we can do what we can to make sure that that redistribution of wealth actually happens, that we all begin to benefit from the opportunities and of course the benefits that, that tourism brings. So it's managed and run by the community for the community and we're completely independent of other utility providers. So, so 70 to 80 percent of those pubs are in rural locations so it was befitting that they asked me to come along today and talk about what I feel uh, is important in the pub industry, uh, rural communities and, and what we do as a pub. We've got some resources, how can we use those best to support you in rural communities, whether that be around tourism, broadband, rural housing, funding opportunities, working together to support our environment. We'll be giving thought to that and we'll be telling you as soon as we possibly can what happens next. So without further ado, huge thanks, enjoy your lunch.